my uh, professorial uh, lecture, uh, which uh, is the chapter about the significance of uh, September 16, 1991, when the Philippine Senate, in a historic vote, decided to shut down the U.S. military bases in the country after almost half a century of uh, being dominated by foreign military bases. This decision, no doubt, was historic, but I think we should look into how it was made possible despite all the obstacles. First, the Senate vote of 1991 must be seen from the perspective of the people's aspirations, historic aspirations, to free our country from foreign domination, as these are legacies not only of the Cold War, but also of our colonial past. When the United States fully supported the Marcos dictatorship from 1972 to early 1986, this support was actually one of the reasons why the senators became more aware of American military motives in the Philippines, and as such, they decided to remove once and, for all, once and for all the American military forces under the U.S. Philippine Basis Treaty. Secondly, the 1987 Constitution in the post-EDSA People Power I revolution that was drafted included a prohibition against nuclear weapons and this legally, I would say, became the legal argument for the senators to remove the U.S. bases, as these bases in the Philippines were known to store and transit nuclear weapons. And finally, there was the factor of the strong, united people's anti-bases movement under the banner of the anti-treaty movement, or ATM, that was that unified the broadest possible sectors in Philippine society to lobby, to sustain mass actions all over, not just around the bases, but all over the country. So all of these factors, together with the arrogance of the United States delegation that negotiated this treaty under Mr. Richard Armitage, who refused to make any written provision in the new agreement that would commit the United States to any form of assistance, military or economic, in exchange for keeping this, their bases in the Philippines for another 10 years. This hardline policy of the United States made it impossible for any of these, for most of the senators to decide in favor of the basis, so that finally 12 out of the 23 senators then sitting in the higher chamber decided on their historic vote on September 16, 1991.